AGI is whatever the companies need it to be. Got it. Do you mind if we back up a sec and just, can you define what AGI is? Because there's a lot of people that are watching the show, that listen to the show, that it sounds like we're all talking about something different. What is AGI and is it ex machina or not? AGI is whatever the companies need it to be. If they want to sell you a convenient product, they are going to talk about AGI as the movie Her and say, this is going to make your life so amazing. It's an operating system for your life. If they want to talk to Congress to ward off regulation, AGI is suddenly this mythical object that will solve climate change and cure cancer. And so AGI morphs, and that's why no one really can say what AGI means, because it shapeshifts based on what the companies need it to be. Like, these companies are trying to build everything machines. The problem with everything machines is that they can't actually do everything. They do some things for some people, because also, time and time again, we've seen through the history of AI development that models have embedded biases based on the data that they're trained on, based on who gets to leave data on the internet and who gets to shape these technologies. Um, and so ultimately, when you position your product as an everything machine, not only are people going to be really confused and start using it for things that it's actually not that good at, and it could lead to a lot of harm, like people asking ChatGPT to read their medical records. Like ChatGPT is not actually designed to be able to do that because it's not 100% accurate 100% of the time. It's a probabilistic machine. Um, and so in the task-specific approach, not only is that better for consumers in terms of it being super clear, like how are you supposed to use this AI model to make sure you get the maximum benefits from it? It also is way better for developers to develop tools that work because then there is a very well-scoped space in which they can test all of the different failure modes of this technology and continue shoring them up. You cannot test all the failure modes for an everything machine.